Bracon. <laughs> Discovering the secret life of plants, also known as the plant life cycles. Hello, young adventurers. Are you ready for a super cool plant adventure? Today, we're going to learn about how plants grow from teeny tiny seeds to big, beautiful flowers and giant trees. Every plant has a story to tell. So, grab your gardening gloves, get set, and let's dig into the amazing world of plants, also known as the plant life cycle. The plant life cycle is divided into three segments. Let's dive into segment one, where we uncover the super cool secrets of the plant life cycle. Every plant starts life as a tiny seed, but how does it transform into the flowers or trees we see around us? That's what we call the plant life cycle. It's a journey from seed to seedling, then to a mature plant, and back to seed again. It's like a plant's version of growing up. Let's dive into segment 2 where we uncover the stages of the plant life cycle. Germination is the first stage. This is when the seed wakes up from its long nap and starts to sprout. It needs water, the right temperature, and good soil to start growing. Imagine if you could grow just by drinking water and lying in the sun. Seedling is the second stage. Once the seed sprouts, it becomes a seedling. This baby plant is ready to stretch its leaves towards the sun. These leaves are like tiny solar panels, soaking up sunlight to help the plant grow. Mature plant is the third stage. As our plant grows up, it gets bigger and stronger, like a superhero. When it's all grown up, it can make its very own seeds, thanks to its colorful flowers or tasty fruits. Those flowers aren't just beautiful, they're also like magical factories that create brand new seeds for more plants to grow. Pollination is the fourth stage. In order to make new seeds, plants need a special thing called pollination. This is when pollen from one flower travels to another. Bees, butterflies, and even the wind can help with this. It's kind of like the flowers are sending secret messages to each other with the help of their tiny buddies. Seed dispersal and starting over is our fifth stage. Once the seeds are ready, they need to find a new home. Some seeds fly on the wind, some hitch a ride on animals, and some even pop out of their fruits to land far away. And so, the cycle begins again with new seeds ready to sprout into new plants. Let's dive into segment 3 where we uncover the importance of the plant life cycle. Have you ever thought about why it's important to know how plants grow? Well, Plants are like superheroes. They give us air to breathe, yummy food to eat, and they even help the planet by cleaning the air. When we know how plants grow, we can take better care of them and our awesome planet. And that's the incredible journey of plants. From a tiny seed to a blooming garden, plants go through amazing changes. Each stage of their life cycle is important for our planet and for us. Thank you for joining me in our Garden of Wonders today. Keep exploring, stay curious, and I'll see you next time for another exciting adventure. Bye-bye. Bracon. -bye. <laughs>